welcome to a DC Universe online podcast, bringing you news and weekly entertainment for the DCUO People's Podcast. What's happening, y'all? This is Nimish Osh, a.k.a. the People's Champion, the host with the most coming at y'all with the People's Podcast. I got a star-studded, awesome cast for y'all today, sitting down with us, and we even got a special guest for that ass. I hope y'all ready for that. First, we got the uh, voice of the people, my man, player one of the EU server, we got Orbit. How you feeling, Orbit? I'm pretty good, mate. Thank you. Excellent, excellent, excellent. <laughs> and... We got the voice of the people, the voice of the people, player one on the U.S. server. Give it up for Super Patron. How you feeling, sir? What's going on, everybody? I'm doing good. <laughs> and we got this my man. This is my dog. You know what I'm saying? He does what he do. He's the Kaiser of double celebration, the voice of the people. Give it up for Big Brother Belkin. Big Brother Belkin, how you feeling, baby? I'm good. Percy! <laughs> <laughs> and, yo, we got this exclusive special guest for you guys. Um, I know absolutely nothing about it, so I'm going to say that she, uh, <laughs> she, has, she needs no introduction. Give it up <laughs> for Jimmy. What's happening, Jimmy? How you feeling, baby? Hi, everyone. I like how you covered that. <laughs> <laughs> Like, literally just met her 30 seconds ago. I don't think she actually knows, <laughs> and I like to curse a lot. No, <laughs> actually, we have met, not met, but, like, we've discussed something in the past before on Twitter, and that was about the only interaction I had with you. Oh. She okay, told yeah, you, to, she told you to stop messaging her. I, think, I remember that, actually, now. No. <laughs> <laughs> Was she telling me to stop being a pest orbit? Is that what she was saying? <laughs> oh, my yeah. God. Yeah. I, oh, thought, oh, I thought oh, Super Patriot was going to have a dig at me later about that. It's he stole it's... your joke, Patriot. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, what? You stole the joke I was going to have, because it was my understanding that Orbit would be the one to be told to look, stop. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, that's what, but, hey, that's why we're the voice of the people. We are the voice of DCUO. I hope y'all understand that. You know what I'm saying? I'm we got the voice people. of double celebration. Yep. Double <laughs> celebration. <laughs> Today's to celebration, no penis. Folks, no. You know, uh, we were, we were kind of doing the rated R thing. We're going to kind of try and break it down to motherfucking PG-13. We're going to see how well that works out. Try and be so we got, PG-13. We got a lot of topics on today's show. And by a lot of topics... We just don't know yet. <laughs> We're pretty much going to wing it. But y'all long for the ride. Y'all going to love what's going to happen here. It's the People's Podcast. You know, We're going to take some of your um, your suggestions, your comments, and uh, we're going to throw them into the show. So if you have any suggestions, feel free to hit us up at our respective Twitter accounts, which we're going to be saying later. And I want y'all to leave messages in the comment, like, favorite, subscribe, and listen to the podcast, baby, because you know, this ain't no, this ain't no project podcast. This is the people's podcast. I hope y'all ready. Right. <laughs> so, Gemini. Oh, shoot. I called you Gemini. 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 It's, it's, her name is Jemmy. Jemmy is Jimmy. fine. I'm, mess, I'm messing up already. Jimmy. I keep yeah. wanting to say like Billy and Jimmy from uh, Double Dragon. Um, Jimmy, uh, tell us a little bit about yourself, Miss Matt. Um... What what do you guys want to know? Oh, oh, <laughs> it's no. a very it's a okay. very general topic. Okay, yeah, very um, vague. What, what server are you from? Uh, how long have you been playing the game? What's your you know power role? Things of that nature. Just you know, do you okay. like long walks on the beach? Oh okay, all right. <laughs> wow, I'm setting that um, up for later, by the way. So oh. Okay, so I'll be sure to answer that one. Um, I started playing DC ever since beta when it came out. I was actually one of the people that bought the box version where you had to go and buy it from Best Buy or any kind of electronic store. Got the free Batman, right, right. Yes, exactly. So, um, yeah, from that point I started playing, and then I play actually on the USPC server, and I don't play on any other server except for that one. 
Um, my main role is nature. I stuck with nature ever since the beginning. Um, I switched from DPS to healing after I found out that I really wasn't much of a DPS person. Um, so <laughs> I just prefer healing now. I love seeing like those green numbers pop up on everyone and it's pretty easy, so it's not bad. See, as a fire tank, as a fire tank, I can appreciate that because I like seeing those green numbers fly up all over my head too. Because yeah, that means fun. somebody's keeping me alive. <laughs> that's true. And uh, wait, what was some? Um, I'm not very much of a long walks on the beach kind of person, but <laughs> I rather just kind of chill on the beach. I'm not really more so like active kind of walking, I guess. Um, now, uh, actually, that question is kind of a, a, a segue into what Super Patriot wanted to talk to you about. Super Patriot, go ahead, take that away, sir. Oh, well, um... Well, are you just, are you not ready? Because, you know, we can jaw jack. Before we get into that, before we get into all that, let me... kids here for a second. So, yeah, go ahead. <laughs> let me, um, act, before we do that, let me uh go around, see how everybody's been doing this week. Uh, Big Brother Belkin, what have you been doing this week in DC, you also? Alright, we're gonna skip Big Brother. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, I was on mute. Right. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah, I listen. Um, this time I'm listening. I'm listening. Be water, my friend. Um, Falcon, 100. percent Let's go. I hundred. Is this 100? percent I un understand. I was this week um, doing some raids, farming exos. Not big things. I mean, I even play other games, not only DCO. Oh. Like Batman cool Arkham Origins, you know, huge Batman fan. Everything what have to do with Batman, I'm playing it. Yeah. Are you, are you not bored of that game though? Because you've completed that about five times. No, it's fun. Okay. Yeah, I like <laughs> it. You have to test it if you never play it, man. I think you will like it too. What What makes you think that? Because everyone likes Batman. <laughs> <laughs> you know what? I wasn't. I wasn't that. A uh, big of a fan of uh, of Batman. I really don't like stealth games. I like kicking down doors and killing everybody. <laughs> That's what I like to do. More Batman like a little Superman. bit too sneaky for my taste. Hey, hey, hey! Batman is like Assassin's Creed, man. It, it Actually, those Batman, like those, those Batman Creed games, the, those, those Batman yeah. games remind me more of Splinter Cell than they yeah. do Assassin's Creed. Like a That's what they remind me of. Cell. It's if you could do so much in the DC universe, not just with the MMO, but I mean, you could have a game that's like, you know, a, a stealthy type situation with super powered characters. And you can't really do that much when you have like a modern setting because you have to stay realistic. But in the DC universe, you know, you could break out Bane. You can, you know, drop down some Kryptonite so Zod or Superman don't get too powerful. You could have a guy like, you know, Joker who has some flair with his his craziness versus in real life people that just be crazy and wearing like regular drab suits and whatnot, and, you know, don't have the, the, the flower spitting acid and whatnot. You know, it's, it's a beautiful thing. It's a beautiful thing. Orbit, big brother Orbit, what's been going on with this week with player one of the EU server? I have finished completely. After what? <laughs> Go what? Orbit. <laughs> <laughs> I have um, completely filled my whole bank full of the arena boxes, ready for season two PvP. Yeah. Filled, mm. rammed. I can't fit anything in it. Anything. Nice. Ready for the stuffed up in there. Huh? Stuffed. Absolutely. Yeah, that's stuffed. a that's a joke that we're not gonna make. Why <laughs> 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 open? <laughs> filling your box so full and so tight, you actually left yourself. Why open? <laughs> well, we're not going to talk about that. We're not going to do it. We're going to continue to have our double celebration week. Because, you know, it is the holiday season. <laughs> Speaking of the holiday season, Orbit, I saw a video that you actually called out to the DCUO community <coughs> to, to do what exactly? Yeah, to make some Christmas videos. And I'm still waiting for yours and yours, Super Patriot, and yours, Jenny, I've, look, I have as been, well. You, I've been working on uh, some other videos for something else that uh, I'm working on with uh, Trex Light right now. Oh, oh you got Christmas I'm come finishing fast. up today. I'm finishing up today, though, so I'll get back to regular video uploadings and everything like that here soon. Super Patriot Christmas style. I will have it. I will have it. Super Patriot. This is like Captain America in red, or what? <laughs> Nimbus Josh, the people's center. <laughs> <laughs> see, and here's the thing. See, I'm thinking... 
I'm thinking this year, I won't necessarily be celebrating Christmas. No, I'm going to be celebrating Festivus for the rest of us. In a sense, I know y'all probably don't know what Festivus is, so I'm going to go ahead and explain. You know, I know exactly Festivus, what that is. Uh, it's a it's yeah. it's a, a, a little they, known holiday that's down here in the states, and you know, there, there's different ways of celebrating it. There's there's the feats of strength in which I'm going to be you know putting my foot in villain ass. You know, that's my feats of strength. There's the airing of the grievances. I'm going to be talking about villains and how how bitch assness <laughs> they have after I put my foot in the ass. You know what I'm saying? There's the decorating <laughs> of the holiday pole, which. I'm going to find a pole in the game, probably a one-hander, and I'm going to shove it. I mean, I'm going to beat the stank <laughs> out of every <laughs> film that I see. You know what I'm saying? And I'm going to decorate it with the blood of justice all up and down Metropolis and Gotham. And that's how I'm going to celebrate the holiday season. But uh, <laughs> I'm just blowing some smoke up your ass. To be perfectly honest with you, you know, I have a, a tradition every year. I read a poem from the Book of the People. <laughs> so I'm going to be doing that, and that's going to be real soon. I got to dust off the holiday sweat and get the mothball smell off it, you know. You're doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. You can't, you can't celebrate like that because Christmas is Give me Christmas. That case. How are you going to tell me super, how to celebrate? Super, 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 <laughs> Superman. How are you going to tell me how to celebrate Christmas? Super, Superman all, hangs his cape up for Christmas. We get to the fact that, you know, I'm, I'm from the South. We celebrate Christmas something completely different. First of all, we walking outside in shorts. There's no snow. No snow to be seen. You know, Santa Claus comes out in culottes. You know, he he comes out. We give him lemonade instead of milk. You well, know, we got we fried turkeys. First, we don't. First, you're talking about in game, and then you're fried talking about out of game. You can't blend them both together. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I'm sorry. Say it again. You're talking about in game, and then you switch to talking about out of game. Yeah. No, no, no. See, because <laughs> you're, you're not you're not going to be you're not going to be painting Nip, blood Nip on this just, um, things just, in real like, life. You know, two miles away from <laughs> the hall. And as everyone knows, the Hall of Doom is New Orleans. So I gotta bring New Orleans. I gotta bring the South to your mouth at any time, especially during the holiday season. So I'm gonna be doing that. Does he mute us, one man, when he's talking? I know you're gonna try and intercept some bullshit. That's what I'm about to say. Let's continue this after. Let's continue this later. We we need the button that mutes him. We've got a guest on here. We've asked her like one question. Yeah. So. Uh, I've actually got. I, I've gonna, got actually something to I, say. Uh, uh, Jimmy, Bep. you, <laughs> <laughs> Jimmy. Um, I, I, Jimmy, I ran across your channel um <laughs> a while ago. Um, you know, and one of the things that uh, I, I've always uh, think one of the things you've been doing um the best uh, things I've seen you do <clears throat> is your uh, legends previews or re reviews of the Leg legends characters and all that. Uh, what made you want to start doing those uh, legends? It like was, that? thank you, first of all. And um, it was actually Devon's idea. And then, of course, since we're a team, we kind of roll <laughs> with it. And we wanted to do the best possible, not more so focusing on, hey, how to clip or how to do high damage or anything like that, but just giving people the option, hey, instead of wasting your marks on something that you'll never end up playing ever again because it's not your thing, why not watch something where it tells you what kind of skills this particular legends has what kind of movements they have or what kind of weapons they use beforehand so that you know before you make that purchase whether it be a marketplace purchase or whether it purchases with your marks you know because uh when you're first starting off or I mean, I'm pretty sure veterans have a long list of Legends characters already, but when you're first starting off, you have only a few marks. You want to be cautious of what you want to spend and make the most out of it. So just giving people that option was the direction we wanted to go. Yeah, because a lot of people know that. I mean, it's not it's not just marks, but, you know, it's you know, some of them are actual, actual money. Exactly. You know? So it's like somebody picks up Lex Luthor thinking, oh, I'm gonna, Lex Luthor is going to be awesome and all, and then all of a sudden they just completely hate him. Exactly. <laughs> yeah, it's like, um, we are you are know, like, you even, dollars even, and you're upset. even better, even better right. example would be Superman. Superman, the most powerful, iconic <laughs> character in the, in the DC universe, and he's probably one of the weakest Legends characters there is. It's really you know, weird, they to, yeah. They had to nerf him, but he's probably one of the weakest Legends characters 
to you. I think me and you gonna have. I'm gonna have to teach you a clinic when I get in on how to right, use yeah. Superman. My 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 bane crazy. against your Superman. We'll do that. We'll do that, Nimbus. Roger, <laughs> your bane against my Superman. It's on. <laughs> oh, it's on. It is on. <laughs> So, so, Jimmy, when you're doing those videos, how many takes does it does it take you to do it? Because when I'm doing videos like that, and when I'm trying to sound all professional, it takes me so many takes. I mess up so many times. Oh, oh, definitely. Um, I, I just have the most recent one I put up yesterday, and it was uh, for Lex Luthor. Ironically, I think Subs just said likes for example, but yeah, um, it took. It takes me from recording to recording my voice and getting everything set up. I think it takes about five, six hours wow, if yeah. I'm trying to work fast. If it's <clears> slow, <throat> then probably like a day and a half. <laughs> yeah. See, I, sounds I, about right. Yeah. <laughs> I, I just can't be, I'm not nowhere near as professional as what you, you are with, with your videos, I'm not going to lie. No, it's so funny because it, it sounds a lot better on video because I always take the try to take the best takes I could possibly do. Yeah. But during the takes, it's just so funny. I'm like, what? How did? It? And then you're like, oh, well, hey, guys, it's DCO Legend Spotlight. And um, we're going to be talking about today. What am I saying again? <laughs> yeah, I, I've done that, too. I, I actually still have a whole bunch of like untitled saved voice recording files. Um, on my computer where I'll be like, hey, what's up, everybody? Welcome to the Daddy South and the VCO commentary. Today I want to talk about fuck. I'll be a good 10 minutes into it, and I'll be like, god damn it, this is fucking bad. You know? <laughs> I was like, stop it. <laughs> I, did, I did a style video. Uh, which style was it? Um, Traces in Time style the other day, and I started off the video with, Hey guys, welcome to Let's Play Celestial with Obestio. And it's like, that's not Let's Play. <laughs> <laughs> we are not playing with Obestio right now. I have this feeling sometimes too. Well, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, one time, if I can say, I was doing Arkham Origins Let's Play and I say, hello guys, this is Balkan. Welcome to Arkham City. <laughs> Later, a guy writes and comment, this is not City, this is Origins. Oh, shit. <laughs> because I was playing before City, my <laughs> first Let's Play, always say City, 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 and then other game. And yeah, it's only one word change, but in my head, I was still on City set. <laughs> right. Yeah. Well, personally, the, I think the first video I ever had trouble with, because all my videos at one time were just cell phone videos, and I just talked shit from the top of my head. But when I actually had to not curse and actually say something from the script, that was the hardest video I had ever done in my life. I even I posted the bloopers to that, because it was just, <laughs> I, I couldn't do it. It was like, how hard is it to make a video without cursing, without cursing the motherfucker out? This is some bullshit. I don't see how y'all do it. I just don't. You can even tell most of my videos now are one takes. You know, I'll talk 10 minutes and not shut the fuck up and not give a damn about a mistake, but oh, we know. But (laughs) 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 But you know, the champion don't make that many mistakes anyway, so you know, it is what it is. With me, you know, I, I, I was in the Navy for 15 years, so I used to use the F word. Really? Like a, um, yeah. So I didn't I mean, know that. You know, Devon is, was in the Navy, too. Oh, yeah? Yeah, so you guys are both sea dogs. Yeah. Well, ex-sea dogs. <laughs> <laughs> I hear good things about the Navy, my friend. <laughs> All yeah. right. <laughs> kind of I don't know what that. Was. You know when it comes from Balkan, it's got hey, that. Hey, Balkan, you know, dirt. master. <laughs> the comments from Balkan are amazing. But yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, the whole the whole phrase, you know, cuss like cuss is like a sailor. I like lived and breathed that. Mm-hmm. Uh, so for the longest time, so for me, whenever I'm doing, you know, like a video or something like that, because you know, I just think, you know, even though you know my kids hear 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 me all the time, anyways. But I just think, you know, I think like other people's kids, but more importantly, what the thing I think about is like, would would I want my grandmother to listen to this? <laughs> and that's what keeps that's what keeps me from cussing so much on my videos. <laughs> oh shit. Then you never can grandma can never see the podcast. Um, <laughs> yeah. Basically, yeah. Podcast, so. 
grandma curse way most more than me. So she sees the podcast like, why you why are you taking it easy on them motherfuckers? You need to get up in that ass, them <laughs> Calling you nimbus. Mommy, <laughs> 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 my, my, my call me nimbus, please. Ah, I, I burst out of school being called nimbus. Just saying. Just saying. Yeah, yeah, just saying. Yeah, yeah, okay. <laughs> Be you're water, like, my friend. You're like, I'm the people's champ. And she's like, yeah, you're whatever you want to be, son. Yeah, my son. <laughs> doctor, doctor smacked me on the ass. I yell, person. <laughs> I think if you sleep and wake up, you know, the alarm clock is ringing. You woke up straight like a vampire. Jump up, person. Exactly. <laughs> like a vampire. Yeah. Crazy, man. So, so Jimmy, Can I say... Yeah, go ahead. Yes, go ahead. No, Lady. go ahead. Ladies first. Oh, can I say that I really love Falcon's voice? Like, I um, I actually found him through the podcast that I was listening to one of them, and I was like, wow. But, by the way, don't you say, like, double penetration rather than celebration? Did you change that? <laughs> I can't say this. I can't <laughs> oh, say this today. I, oh, okay, so it's more PG. Okay, gotcha. We were trying um, to do like a holiday Christmas episode. Oh. It's okay. Okay. Did I mess that I, up? I'm I, so I, su- I suggested to Balkan <laughs> that we should have less double, double penetration and more oh, okay. celebration. But if you want double penetration, <laughs> Jemmy, you know, you might be able to. <laughs> no, no, I don't know. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> Right and there, thanks man. for liking my exit, podcast. my voice. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> no, I mean, like, you could say it. I don't mind celebration, penetration, just either or. As long as penetration is not directed towards me, it's okay. <laughs> <laughs> well, he's, but, been, um, he's been directing it as a super patron. Less double the penetration, <laughs> more celebration. I say double penetration is the celebration. So. Oh. <laughs> That, that makes sense. Okay. <laughs> well, no, we're just uh, joking. You know, insiders. How you know. often are you celebrating oh. then, Balkan? I don't celebrate them. I wish <laughs> other people to double penetration, <laughs> not myself, my friends. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, man. So I found him through this podcast and then I watched a couple of his videos and I gotta say I really enjoy like your voice and narrative. Um one thing I have to say is that um I realized that some of the comments I read some and one was particularly hurtful and I feel like that goes for the same for all of you um narrators who are DC commentators as well. That, you know, when someone says, like, something about your accent or something about how the way you talk, it shouldn't be, like, don't take that to heart and never let that get to you. Because, you know, it's about, like, just presenting the information and it makes you unique in a way. So I just wanted to say that I particularly find your voice very easy on the ears and actually entertaining at the same time. And it doesn't sound flat and that goes for all the rest and you guys have very unique voices Nimbus you Thank have you. such a um, energetic I heard this before though like but energetic it's like always sounds pumped up in a way like after hearing your video it always sounds like alright I'm ready to go do something I'm gonna smash the table <laughs> Nimbus smash <laughs> yeah and for Orbitz it's just like um, that European accent. I don't know. It's just something about it. In a way. I think, wait, are you? British. <laughs> British, right? Yeah, yeah. No? Yeah, okay. Yeah, British. And Balkan, what are, are you British as well? No, 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 right? no. I live in Germany, but my parents come from Croatia, Serbia, so. Oh, yeah. okay. I talk so... with English, free languages, so it's a bit hard for me to understand and talk English, but I give my best. I learn every day more and more, and I have to say, I learn English from DC, not from school a lot. (laughs) That's good, in a way. It's always good to, like, jump in and get your feet wet, and with Super Patriot, of course, you know, just, I hear you majority of the time, like, every day, so it sounds like home, and it's always informational, so I want to say to you guys, like, never let someone tell you down. It's yeah. always just provide the information the best that you possibly can. Now, don't go, like, hurting other people, but just try to stay neutral and try to, try to stay, you know, good and always have confidence in yourself. 
Yeah, well, see, the thing that cracks me up about some of the people out there, like, especially, like, in Balkan's case, and all that, people, you know, tell them, say, you'll learn how to speak English. The dude speaks three languages, and I'm sorry, some people, especially one individual that was telling him to learn how to speak English, I'm sorry, Balkan <coughs> speaks better English than he does. So, <laughs> <it's> like, <laughs> so, I mean, it's like... They, Nimbus know, is choking on something. Guys, Nimbus is, uh, he's, choking cho he's choking down a name right now. He's choking down <laughs> somebody's name right now. <laughs> but I mean, yeah, I mean, I mean, Balkan speaks better English than you know some individuals that I know. You know that you know. Thank you. Know, you. Are English speakers? So, I mean, I don't know where you know, and and, and that's ridiculous. That's a ridiculous thing to tell somebody. You know, it's like learn how to speak mm -hmm. English when, especially when it's like the dude's like fourth language. Right. You know what I mean? <laughs> it's like, and he's and, doing, honestly, and you can understand him fine. Right. And honestly, who says that it has to be in English? I mean, um, yeah. half our server is a U.S., I mean, EU server. And I'm pretty sure there's a lot of other German people who play, a lot of other other cultural people yep. who play. Yep. You could totally yeah. make it in a different language and, you know, it'll be successful. And maybe people will like it more because, you know, you're catering to a different group of people that don't have to under English um, understand English so well. Mm -hmm. Right, and then on top of that too, there's supposed to be adding a uh, Asian server to the game. Oh, yeah, I heard is that. that really? I heard that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Asian yeah, server. Adding, joking. adding an Asian server to the game. No, I'm not okay, joking. Okay, guys. Okay, guys. I'm gonna dominate over the Korean server. Just to let you know ahead of time. That's my market now. <laughs> let's all, let's make a league. Let's make a, meet, like, a league on the Asian server. <laughs> you call us the jacuzzi, jacuzzi Europe US. <laughs> jacuzzi. What? Not jacuzzi, jacuzzi. What's that? I mean, my, my name Yakuza? is jacuzzi. I'm from yeah, over there. People love me. It's a Japanese gangsters. Speaking of, though, like the negative comments that you get all the time and all, this is something I was actually wanting to talk to you about you know, because you have a unique perspective on it. Um, at least unique, you know, as, you know, between the four of us, at least. Mm -hmm. Um is the fact that, I mean, you not only are you a gamer and all that, not only are you a YouTuber, but you're also a female gamer and a female YouTuber. I mean, how, I mean, how do you deal, how do you cope and deal with, like, not just the negative comments, but a lot of the more harassing comments mm, and remarks that you get, not just on your channel, but in the game as well? Well, actually, I'm not as popular as I sound, I guess, in a way. So <laughs> when I'm on game, I don't really get a lot of tells. Majority of the time when I do, it's like, hey, I watch your videos. I love you. And if you want help, definitely, you know, hit me up or something like that, which is always light. And I never really got in any trouble with that yet. Mm -hmm. Um as far as for YouTube, again, people can say what they want to say. All I have is the power to, you know, just simply ban you off my thing if I find it, you know, really, really um, bad. I'll leave the ones up that explain your opinion because that, that's your opinion and I'll say mine. But mm -hmm. if it's something where it's like, I'm going to shoot you or I'm going to, <laughs> you know, fight you. We have to fight. And I'm like. When did I say I was ever good at PvP or anything? This is completely ridiculous. <laughs> people right. people say and, the most ridiculous things on Yeah. Y yes. You don't you exactly. don't even need to mention anything and they you know, oh, oh what you think you're so good huh? and stuff like right. that. Right. So it's <laughs> totally like I am you could say what you want to say, you have the power to write it. I definitely have the power to remove it and just keep the positive in my life. So just focusing on the good is always the direction you want to go. I try to <clears throat> ignore all the bad because it's easy for people to be bad on the internet, unfortunately. It's, yeah. It's just easy for people <clears throat> to say mean things, to write mean things. Well, because they're covered by a picture that's not of them or they're covered by a glass screen that they'll never meet this person who's halfway across the world. So, yeah. Arena <clears throat> jockeys. <clears throat> <laughs> Ooh, is everything okay you need water my friend <laughs> oh it's so cute how he says water <laughs> sorry oh i'm uh, you like, uh, jimmy if you like that watch this nuclear vessels nuclear vessels nuclear vessels that's so cute Vessel. <laughs> hey, Super Patriot, Love State's that. working. 
Twerky. Please. That'd be cute. Yeah. Say it. <laughs> what? Twerk. Twerk. <laughs> they pronounced the whole word like this. Oh, that's so cute. Wait, how do European people say it? How do you say what? How do European people twerking? Wait, do they say twerking like that? Twerking. European twerking. Twerking. What does it call twerking? Do y'all have twerking? Do you have that extra hinge in our spine to actually do that? Isn't twerking a dance? I mean. Twerking is actually not condensed word i think it's just a word a coined word uh-huh. yeah it's a word it's that a, came it's out a word that um, it's it's funny that you mention that because i happen to be an expert on the topic no. being <laughs> from New Orleans, my son. actually yeah. actually being around for the creation Nimbus, of Nimbus the word twerks twerks all the time. actually literally being twerked Nimbus twerks on. all the time that, no, that's I how get we, that's how on we, all the time. No, you twerk. Like, you down twerk. here, we have something called New Orleans Bounce. I showed you the hammer video. I'm going to have to post that in the description or whatnot. But um, down here, the women down here is ratchet, right? They will sit there, and they will just start popping on you and twerking on you and whatnot. They, just <laughs> randomly. Just imagine just some random chick all of a sudden walks up and starts umping on you. That's what it's like in New Orleans. You will never have to pay for a lap dance ever again in New Orleans. Lap dances are free. Ah, okay. You just get them <laughs> random. Falcons Wait, do they have tickets. twerking in Europe? <laughs> yeah. That's what I was asking. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, they no, do? No. Yeah. Do they have twerking in Germany? <laughs> Falcon. I think, yes, maybe they call it different. I see they're, twerking's, someone twerking's like yeah, being shaking worldwide because like of the, like the vines and like the twerking vines and stuff. Twerking vines? Yeah. Like the little six like, second yeah, videos like the, on the internet. Like the short oh, videos, vines. Yeah. Oh, okay. I'm totally out of that one. I've on never Facebook. done it. Yeah. Vines. Girl is twerking, blah, 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 and something. Like, yeah. have you seen the one where she's twerking, like, upside down against the door, and the, someone opens the door, and she goes, she falls into that the... Was, have you seen that one? Yeah, that was good. It's actually <laughs> was, um, a stunt. That was a Jimmy Kimmel skit. Yeah, yeah that was, was fake. It was fake. It was fake, though, right? <laughs> It was pretty oh. good. It was, it was really pretty good, good though. Yeah, it was pretty, pretty, pretty realistic. But yeah, funny. But yeah, like videos like that have just like, been like, yeah, twerk. I think there's even a twerking song, isn't there? Wow, there's, there's a an English twerk. Song. You've heard like, it here first, exclusively in North America. <laughs> there's an English twerking video. Twerking is worldwide, baby. Look, worldwide. Let, let me, let me it's play like it. It's like Gangnam Style, you know, everywhere. Oh my god, that's so cute. Gang gang style. <laughs> She's gonna keep you make me shy now. I, I can't talk. I'm so sorry. Okay. I'm so sorry. Sorry. Okay, I'm so sorry. Like, she, we were just talking she about gonna... that little bit of extra attention that girls get. And here you are just fawning over his accent and whatnot. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. That is hilarious. I think up and put, her in a, put him in her pocket and just like take him I know. Off. Cut him in my like, <laughs> um, Joker's present box or something and just wrap him up there. Just yeah. every so often, pull them out your pocket, squeeze them exactly. in the belly, and says double penetration. And just... Yeah, exactly. And then put them back Don't in. Don't try to talk like me, man. <laughs> you got to put a little screen on his back. penetration. Just, that's, that's what we need. That's what we need to do. That's what we need to do for the show. We need to we need to get a uh, Balkan um, doll with, uh, you know, the string that you pull on the back. And it just does his little, little uh, one-liner things. Oh, that's cute. You know? Just pull a string. Double, double penetration. Yeah, double penetration. <laughs> Patriot F. I don't know. What do you have? Has... Patriot doesn't have anything. Patriot is like, he is Wonder Bread. He has nothing. <laughs> he ain't got... <laughs> oh my God. <laughs> it's too much like, welcome, buddy. That is how's another Say, DCU old commentary. That's the only thing I know. <laughs> okay, you guys take care. Bye. See, I, see, I don't, <laughs> know, I don't, I don't know, know I have anything break. either. I need to, yeah, I need to get something. I don't really you know, have Orbit, anything you don't have either. A, I think, uh, like, I thought I gave you a catchphrase with "get on my level" or "get off my lawn," and you haven't used that. You didn't give you it feel. to me. You didn't know give it to I, me. I totally gave you that. No, it would sound weird. European accented. Wait, try yeah. it out. Um, try it out. Get. Well, you see, we don't say we don't say lawn. We say garden. That's even better. That's even better. No, it would take local, away from the effect. Like exactly. Get off my garden. Get, get on my level and get, get off, off my, my garden. Get off my garden. Get off my garden. Plus, you can see something new. If you don't believe me, bring your posse, bring your crew. 
You'll I'm get gonna some start like saying masculinity that. points using that garden thing. Get on my level or get off my garden. <laughs> get off my garden of petunias. <laughs> <laughs> Feel free to hate because I ain't trying to be your mate. Be serious, you wouldn't last an hour in my shoe. I did say I don't that's, I did say that's any the way cookie I'm crumbles sorry. once. <laughs> hashtag cookie crumbles in PvP chat for ages. So I might add that one in. That's the way the cookie crumbles. <clears throat> that's an anchor <laughs> thing, though, isn't it? I don't know, is it? Yes, it was from a movie. From Bruce Almighty, Jim Carrey. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh. But I need to, I need, to, I need like something, I need something like that. Something to snap. Well, I don't wait. have one either, if it makes you feel any better. Mm, doesn't really. But Jim Carrey oh. was written like in the Batman movie, right? Or not? Well, I got catchphrases to spare. If you ever, if okay, you ever want, we can sit down and develop. Yeah. So, Nimbus, Nimbus, that's your project. You got to come. You got Nimbus. Nimbus signs off ten. with like five catchphrases. <laughs> that's, that's how he signs off every video. I sign like, off with his sermon. Video is is catchphrases. Like, we do what it do. We finish the job. Finish the sermon. Yeah, it's like an entire sermon. <laughs> 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 Line your butter and holla back, at your boy. <laughs> yeah, it's, it's okay. Seven. <laughs> <laughs> You've got seven catchphrases you sign off every video with. <laughs> yeah, that's why me. That's why me, Jimmy, and uh, Orbit don't have any catchphrases. Nimbus stole them all. <laughs> that's not true. No, except for one. I I think at the I end of mine, I always say bye bye, and that's it. Yeah, yeah that's I true. do have I do have bye that bye. one. I do have that one that I try. I started hashtagging. Every once in a while, I hashtag it. That zero pause for justice. I've never, never. I always never. say that at the end of the well, video. I, I, I hope you enjoyed this lot. video. See ya and have fun. The yeah. bucket double has penetration. double penetration. Yeah. I have a lot of hashtags. Double penetration. <laughs> uh, that's it. Okay. That's it. <laughs> <laughs> so, uh, You've got double. Hashtag double. Hashtag God. penetration. Okay, the other hashtag is DP, shortcut for double penetration. <laughs> shortcut. Aww, so cute. Yo, uh, in the comment section, I want y'all to put down, what is your character's catchphrase? Just fill up our comments with what you have. What's your, what's your hashtag? What's your catchphrase? What hashtags do you like seeing when you're on Twitter or Facebook or Tumblr? Feel free for audience participation, you feel what I'm saying? We should really just, start talking about DC Universe. We were just talking. <laughs> should we start talking One time about I game? write hashtag <laughs> double penetration on Facebook, then I click on the hashtag and I sell a lot of weird stuff. Oh so my God. Not... <laughs> <laughs> of course, that might end up that way. So maybe we'll put like DC duo double penetration. I need a new hashtag. It's not good. Good thing your hashtag is <laughs> not child friendly. Double se- sure. hashtag double hit. celebration. That's what you need. Nah, celebration is at Christmas, Easter maybe. But ah, try triple penetration. Ooh, you dirty. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> this is a class higher triple. Yeah, and then when you click on that hashtag, I bet it'll be Oh, worse. no, I don't want to click on this You don't hashtag. want to click on it? Okay, that's fair the game. Is, his reaction to that was like, oh, triple, t- oh, you're dirty. Like, double penetration is so classy. You know? yeah, double penetration is okay, but the triple one, you know, this is too heavy even for me, you know. It's too heavy for you? Nah, oh. I'm just messing oh, they don't talk about this on other podcasts. Balkan, you pawns. Balkan's a pawn star. This is the DCO Peggy 18 sex podcast. Double penetration. <laughs> wow. Oh, Wait, man. I'm the only girl here. That's bad. <laughs> oh, okay. No, no, no. I hey, removed yeah, I'm over here drinking my eggnog, chilling. You know what I'm saying? Bal- Balkan, like, I'm married to justice. So. Y'all, y'all work that out yourselves because that's what lads do. <laughs> <laughs> Lads, dude. <laughs> but it's funny, you know, we oh, talk man. never talk us about DP, but it's still not boring. This is cool, you know. <laughs> We're still not sitting here playing with dolls and whatnot. With dolls. Not doing yeah. that. Yeah, which, huh? uh, which, which I got, there was another preview picture that I tried to show you guys that, um, 
Uh, unfortunately, you guys weren't able to see. I'm really looking forward to seeing, you know, the introduction of my action figure. To, uh... <laughs> already has his action figure, complete with action in action. Yeah. Really? You really have an action figure? No way. Oh, yeah, got an action figure right now. If you go to uh, if you go to Nimbus underscore Yosh, you can get the details. I gotta find the details and make one now. It's you this. can get the details on how to get the Nimbus Yosh action figure. Add some Percy to your holiday. And if you Holla pre-order back. now, you got the strap on for free. Wow. <laughs> Wait a minute. Action I can't be a part of this one. Uh, I'm married, so you guys can handle that. What you're going to use that for? Falcon. Wow. Yeah. Falcon. So, uh, you, you understand, Jimmy? Me, me, and Nimbus, we've we've got a totally different class of haters. We got, we got, we got, oh. we got people out there that are you know playing with dolls, you know, oh. and talking about us. us. So. But moving on. Um, last week, uh, they did a special live stream. Uh, <laughs> Revealing some of the uh, DLC Nine War of the Light Part One, Part Uno, Part uh, what's 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 one in German, Falcon? One eins. Eins. Yeah. Eins. I used to know that. Wait, is that wrong? No, it's wrong. Yeah. Eins is in Heinz ketchup, pretty much. (laughs) What? Not (laughs) Heinz. It's without a. Yeah, yeah, but it sounds the same. Is what I'm saying. It sounds the same. I know how to say no in German. No? Nine? Yeah. Nine. Sounds like the number nine. Nine. Yeah. That's all I could say in German. So when I go to Germany, I'm going to say nine. 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 It's yeah. Yeah. I got a feeling if you got around Balkan and all that, talking about double penetration, you'd have to say nine a lot. I'll be saying nine. 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 All that I learned from German, I learned from Du Hast. That song a long time ago. They used to play in the clubs. <laughs> all I do, do host, do host, mate. That's all I know. That's the whole. That's all. Ah, I know. this that's is from song. this rock band, German, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Ramstein. So, Ramstein. War of the Light Part One. Let's start yes, with. Yes, War of the Light Part One. Let's start mm-hmm. with the main thing that people are going to be talking about: the rage powers. Yeah. Ooh. Rage Powers. Who's excited for Rage Powers? Red Lantern. Okay. I'm very excited for the Rage Powers. Mm. I'm gonna switch to. I'm gonna. I'm gonna switch to it and uh, test it out. And see, so, you know, the tanky mechanic sounds really interesting to me. I think it sounds think... overpowered. <laughs> see, Please I think explain. I think it's only gonna be overpowered though in the hands of people who like master the whole you know mitigation cancellation yeah. thing. But the thing is, like. It's like this game's not overly difficult. There's going to be a lot of people who's going to be able to master that. And if you go into so into wait, PvP, wait. so um, can y'all explain to us uh, non tanks, um, what you mean <laughs> by you know the mitigation over cancellation, so on and so forth. All right. Well, basically, the way the way the rage powers are going to work, as far as tanking is concerned, is that you're the way you're going to be able to absorb a lot of damage because it sounds it sounds like to me is like a combination of earth and ice with this um that you're going to be able to absorb a lot of dangers uh damage by you know enraging yourself by activating one of your rage powers so you activate this rage power right and you're going to basically be able to absorb all damage that you take in however that after after a short period and all that you're in danger of having a rage crash and when you have a rage crash even if you know, that, that's when all the damage that you've absorbed that hits you all at once. Wow. Mm, I've got yeah. I've got oh, I've got it actually written down here. Let me tell you exactly what it says word for word. It says uh duh, 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 duh. rage crash. Players can activate certain abilities to send them into <clears throat> a state of extreme rage. <clears throat> when in this state, any damage taken is instantly healed. The effect lasts for the duration of the ability. And once the ability fades, all of the damage taken during that time is instantly reapplied to the character. So if you're constantly doing your abilities, abilities, and you're rotating effectively, you're invincible. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, if you, yeah, if, if you can do it perfectly, yeah. You see, that that's the thing. It's, there's ways of preventing the rage crash from happening. 
you that's can't a, that's either, gotta um, be overpowered. That has to be a, unless the cool guy is. Let's well, see. Here's the thing. Here's the Busty thing. Here's the hell. thing. Here's the thing. Because I actually uh, got caught up in a conversation with um, Jens Anderson on Twitter um, the other day, um, where you know me and a couple of guys were talking to asking him about how exactly these rage powers are going to be working. How you know we're going to be able to you know because it's a, because technically it's a it's a lantern power so it's like uh, you know we're wondering if there's going to be any combos in it, like we have with hard light or if there's mm-hmm. going to be a uh, combo into other powers like we do with celestial and he's basically said it's, it's more like celestial so we'll be like comboing into these powers um some of them but the ones that we so basically if you want to keep your uh, rage up and prevent the rage crash without taking any more damage, like a rage crash immunity. Okay, um, you're gonna have to combo one of these powers. However, there are going to be other powers that you can just cast. All right, just to mitigate the damage. I'm seeing because of the simple fact that you know, I mean, the timing is gonna probably have to be perfect. You know, mm-hmm. I mean, the timing is gonna have to be perfect. Like you know, you know, we, we've all run into like ice tanks who like can perfectly cycle all their shields, you know, to where they're like barely taking any damage on the whole time. Um, I think it's going to be people that, you know, that are similar to, to doing that, you know, keeping, you know, their shields up the whole time to mitigate damage and everything. I mean, those are the guys that are going to be able to go out there and like master this power. I mean, it's, it's going to take a lot of practice. I, I can almost guarantee you that. It doesn't sound the greatest tank power ever. It's 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 it stands that possibility. Yeah, we'll have to wait and see about the like actually see it in action, really. Yeah, if it's out on test server, I will test it anyway. (laughs) Yeah, I I know. I'm coming to you as a full full rage tank. Yeah, when you're in troll stance, and I'm going to stick my weapon up your ass. Hey, be nice. Be nice. That's right, swoop attack, bitches. <laughs> Cut that right the fuck short. I'm they sorry, you raging? Uh, they said this DLC is going to be next year, correct? Yeah. Yes. Okay. Well, I mean, next year is in what, 15 days? I'm, well, <laughs> more, than likely, more than likely, we're probably looking at a, uh, we're looking at a January or February release with this DLC, more than likely, what I'm thinking. <laughs> You know, for us um, people who do YouTube, when a DLC comes out, that's when we're the most busiest and have to get ready and stuff. Oh, yeah. Well, excuse me. You, YouTube. When you have a YouTube like the People's Champs YouTube that does nothing but shit talk, we don't have to worry about it. <laughs> oh, okay. We don't have to worry about it. We don't get the views y'all get. You know what I'm saying? But we don't have to worry about, oh, there's a new there's a new DLC coming out? How's the PvP? No PvP? Fuck it, I'm back to kicking this dude's ass. Yeah. That's all we got. I, I feel for y'all though. I think I might do a little something about that, but no, 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 no. I'm not really into the whole PVE. Speaking of PVP though, when's that update gonna hit? I just I want whoop a villain ass though. I know, what is man. that coming out? I'm I'm guessing next month. I'm guessing next month for the PVP. Mm. Now, I'm I got my our... exo bits oh, ready. But <laughs> I got I got my PvP, dubstep ready. <clears throat> Speaking of PvP with this uh, DLC, we're getting two new Legends characters. Oh, Ooh, Saint Walker. Atrocitus and Saint Walker. There you go, yep. Trust two two more Walker. videos for you, Jemmy. Yay! Yep, for you, and you're gonna... Wait, hold on. I think they're Marketplace buys, though. Or either they're DLC... No, they're not part of the DLC. Are they? No, I think they're, they're part of the DLC. Yeah, so yeah, there's yeah. speculation of what the actual... There's speculation about what the actual... You know, if there's... You know, they... Because they always do this. They introduce two with the, with the DLC, and then they have two on the marketplace. So, oh. what do you guys think is going to be on the marketplace? Well, and y'all want to see? Y'all, y'all know uh, Jim is going to do the video on that. So, we're going to put the link in the doobly-doo. So, you can go ahead and click on that whenever that's ready. And check out all her other videos beforehand. Thank you very yeah. much. Shameless plug. We'll put an extra advertisement oh. for you because, you know, we do what we do. Thank you very much. It's much appreciated. <laughs> Matter of fact, but, how about uh, what is your YouTube channel? Go ahead and say that in your YouTube, your Twitter, and any other social network, and that we really should be clicking on right now as she says it. 
or actually well, at hey. the end of the show, at the end of the podcast. So when we normally do, we'll open stuff. Open the <laughs> <laughs> open the new I'm gonna do it as soon as she says it. You know, what I'm saying so. Go ahead, open a new window. Go ahead, type in your little URL. What we got for you, uh, Jimmy? Okay. So my YouTube channel is um, DCUO Crisis Core. It was based on our league at the time, but it only consisted of like two people. <laughs> so not much of a league. Um, and you could, as well, youtube.com backslash DCO Crisis Core, or you could just type in the search bar. My Twitter is at Geminis Gamer, spelled G-E-M-I-N-E-S-S, Gamer, one word. And my Facebook is Geminis01. Can I just say something, Jemmy? Yes, ma'am. Oh, you, sir. You sound very similar to my Siri person. Let me <laughs> let me see. Let me test this out. Who? Hello. How are you today? Very well, thank you. That's you. Very well, thank you. <laughs> nah, it doesn't sound same, man. It yeah, does. You wash your ears, man. It does. <laughs> how did you get? How did you get Jimmy in your uh, in your uh, iPad, iPod, iPhone, whatever it is <laughs> that you get these days? I just selected her. I've got Jemmy, I've got Super Patriot down here. No, I don't. Do you have Vulcan? Yeah, I do actually. Hello, how are you? Double penetration. Yeah. <laughs> <What>? <laughs> <laughs> wow. I just the the DC you will price his core. You know what I'm saying? I suggest all y'all do the same, like right now. As soon as you hear this podcast, you know, uh as soon as it's over, or open up a new tab if you if you're on your computers or whatnot, and go to the 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 what is it DCUO Crisis Core. It's beautiful. You, know you, are, doing I, I love a, you are doing the selling the job today, Josh. Thank you. Well, you know. Yes, I do. You think I can get tell. <laughs> <laughs> you think he gets paid for it, but he actually does it. He does it for free because. Good YouTube does this for keeps free, to be subscribed to. YouTubes that either offer loads of entertainment, you know what I'm saying, or offers loads of news and reviews that you can use. Not stuff that'll make you do, I don't know, 31K damage and troll roll, nothing like that. You, know, you want to <laughs> log off to that nonsense. Just saying. You know, you want to log off to the nonsense with these guys playing with dolls and whatnot. You need to leave that alone. Come to the real YouTubers and get your game up and get your entertainment up. Just saying. Just saying. Mm-hmm. That's so, so random. what else are we going to talk about today before we get into uh, the... Well, we this is going to be a heated episode we were talking of about Beast of Bust. We, we, so, we, yeah, we... we were talking about the DLC still, Nimbus, and we were talking about <laughs> Legends mm-hmm. characters and who you think <clears throat> they're going to introduce on the marketplace for Legends. <sighs> gotcha. <laughs> if the majority of the lanterns are there now. Course, I think he will be a brawl and Saint Walker martial arts, in my opinion. And both of these are the rage powers. Nah, Saint Walker can't be rage. He's a blue lantern. He has maybe his own oh, powers, okay. like Metallo, maybe. I actually don't know what Saint, Saint Walker looks Saint, like. So. Saint Wa- he looks Walker like is, um, um, blue light, from Dragon um, Ball Z. Boo. Blue lantern maybe. of hope. He's uh, a Saint, big dude. Saint White. No, he's a tin guy. Tin guy. Blue, la- blue light, oh. blue lantern of hope. And he's going to be using martial arts. How you know this? Ah, I know. I he know does stuff. No, I do. It's right in front of me. Saint Walker wields the blue light of hope. His combat, <laughs> his combat style is martial arts, which is very fitting for Saint Walker, who always felt to me. Like a graceful fighting monk, blah 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 blah. You sent me this link, Super Patriot. <laughs> Did I? Yeah. I didn't see that on here. <laughs> it's got a section on Legends characters. Oh, okay. So you do y'all speculate there's going to be Blue Lanterns in the future? Oh, absolutely. Maybe. I mean, yeah. they're, I mean, they're introducing a Blue Lantern into Legends. I mean, the power's coming. It's just a matter of when and what role it's going to be. But more listen, than likely, more than likely, I think it's going to be a healer. But listen, listen, so how they want to put be a healer class. Blue Lantern in the game? I mean, they say it's comic based. I mean, Blue Lanterns can't. At the moment, even in the comics, they're never on the villain side. Second, 
uh, if Green Lantern stays to an, next to Blue Lantern, the Green Lantern gets overpowered. I mean, his ring charges over hundred percent. So, I I kind of agree. Like, I don't think he's gonna be a power because just because like we have a Legends character didn't really mean that it equaled out to a power. Because if you look, Sinestro is on here, but we don't have you know the fear power. If you know what I mean? Yeah, we do. The villains yeah, we have, have yellow, yellow rings. <laughs> yeah, the vill villains have yellow ears. No, they don't. Yeah, really? So Hold on. Yeah. Yeah. As, a, as a power? Yeah, um, with the hot light. Like, yeah. yeah. For with the, heroes, it's like for light, light, though. Hot light, though. Yeah. Hot changing between green and yellow, right? Yeah. Okay. So sorry, I was tripping. I have not <laughs> said of the villain side for a very long time. <laughs> so, so, so the legend reviewer doesn't really know too much about legends. You just ran out. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Well, no, no, no. Joking. Well, technically, how... it's not a legends review. Technically, it's a power review. I don't know a lot about the power. Ah, uh, yeah, very true. Very true, very true. Eat myself. <laughs> Quick cover up. Quick cover. Up. Good job. But I hope they don't bring but... another lantern out. Otherwise, we're gonna have too many lantern powers. I don't really, well, I, mean, I see them. I can see them because you know they are introducing you know Sam Walker in there. I mean, I could see it as a possibility. Um, the thing is, the blue, you know, it would have to be another class. It can't be another controller class because we've got already got a you know lantern controller class. You know, with with rage coming in, we're going to have a lantern tanking class. So blue and blue makes more sense as a healer class than either of the other two for me and. There is a pos there is a way for them to do blue for hero and another color for uh, the villain side. It was brought up um, mm -hmm. by somebody. Um, they were talking oh, about the indigo lantern. How many colors are there? No, no there's nice. the, the entire rainbow, man. The <laughs> color of the rainbow. I can tell the colors. <laughs> wow. From I got black to white and all the colors in between. Black to yeah. All the colors in the rainbow, between. In the rainbow. So I mean, I mean, it, it's a I mean, possibility. We're going to be dealing with orange lan uh, and orange lantern really soon, you know, with the Christmas uh, situation. Oh, excuse me, yes. holiday situation. Sorry about that. Yes. Well, they, they'll Hopefully. have um, a blue, like a blue lantern template with some moves bringing out Saint Walker as a Legends character, but um, I, at least not for ages. Yeah, it's not going to be for. It'll be introduced more of the other War for the Light DLCs, you know, if not. More than likely, too, which there's like after War for the Light One, there's two other DLCs, and before War for the Light Two comes out, so we could be looking at something you know, like Blue Lanterns, Blues Light coming in like late next year <coughs> or early 2015, if they do introduce them. Well, let but, me. I mean, also, oh, go ahead. I was going to say, let me talk to you a little bit about the the other character for legends because it tells you a little bit about about it yes atrocitus. um yeah what's his name atros atro atrocitus 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 the head of the red Lantern. yeah pretty much says here uh -huh. at atrocitus as you would expect is completely brutal he is all about damage and very little in defense but hang on don't get worried it says, let's talk about the mechanics. Just like the rage powers, Atrocitus can go into a state of rage that allows him to instantly heal any incoming damage, allowing him to wade through incoming attacks and deal out some punishing, um, some punishment. Blah, 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 blah. So, yeah, he'll be able to go into a state of rage and be invincible for a while. He says he has a move that was awesome. Blood spewing attack creates a huge pool of plasma. And, yeah. So basically, yeah, kind of like, basically, kind of like what we run into with at in the uh, Coast City. Yeah, DLC. yeah, 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 yeah. Sounds good, man. He sounds good. Yeah, sounds good. And the the rage power. I don't know. I, I, don't know, I think we forgot to mention this. the rage power. Uh, the damage um, uh, powers are all might based. So a lot of the. Uh, so I, I'm not going to have to remod. <laughs> uh -huh. <laughs> With all, you know, you, you know, except until we get all the new gear. Speaking of which, the new gear and all that that we're getting with uh, the War of the Light operations, they're uh, giving us two new operations. Uh, I'm sorry, three operations per faction. Um, two are four-player and one is an eight-player, which I was, honestly, I was kind of surprised it was going to be an eight-player because they always, um, they put this out, you know, always said this was going to be a small group content 
DLC similar to uh, Sons of Trigon. Um, so I was actually surprised that uh, the eight man ops going to be in there, but uh, it's uh, I mean, it's looking good. The thing I like the most about this though is that uh, they've based they they've taken the weapons and they have put them on the uh, vendors. So that means they're not going to be in. They're not going to be dropping at all in any of the operations. The weapons themselves are going to be on the vendors. So the gear that that uh, we're going to be dro- that's going to be dropping, which is supposed to be slightly higher than the gear we get from the vendors. All right, that means we'll actually have a better chance of getting it because there won't be the, because the weapons aren't going to be on the loot tables at all. What do you guys think about that? That's, I love the fact that you can actually earn all of your uh, your drops. Well, <clears throat> most of the drops, you know what I'm saying? Uh, you could be viable by going in and actually grinding out instead of going in and, you know, basically rolling the dice and hoping that you get what you need for your character. That's going to cut down on uh, a lot of misering. That's going to cut down on a lot of, um, how did I put this, uh, searching for uh, exploits and searching for ways to actually do things uh, not as legitimately when you sit when you sit there and you earn what you have to earn, then you appreciate it more. And I I really appreciate that they're actually making it to where you can you have to buy your gear instead of hoping that it's going to drop and then have them do it over and over because that just gets frustrating. Yeah, <laughs> Vulcan. Yeah, Vulcan. You, are you happy about the weapons being on the vendors? Which weapons? Oh my god. <laughs> oh my Jesus. I'm which weapons? Wait, wait, which weapons? The weapons there. Ah, yeah, yeah, 90 CR. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh, this you mean. I think a new weapon style. Falcon. I, this is 100%. You need to give 110% then. <laughs> I yeah, give 200. Yeah. No, no, no. We, it's we okay. Need 150% I mean, look. for you because your 100% is not good enough. All right. <laughs> <laughs> Uh, so, I mean, it's cool that we get now stronger weapon. The only thing is, you know, I was always running with my league and other people's, you know, paradox to get a gear. And one DLC, you can't forget paradox. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Well, but, you I, I, yeah, I think it's a good idea. You got like people who use certain weapons that works with sp- their loadout that they're using, and yeah. now they're not going to have to use a random weapon because that's what they picked up, and it's better than their stats. They can actually select what le- weapon they want and use that weapon. Like I still have not got a one-handed, and that's my weapon. I have one in at eighty-eight. Ooh, well done. Be good water, for you. my friend. <laughs> <laughs> Be water, my friend. You know, empty your mind. <laughs> Be formless, <laughs> shapeless, like water. So yeah, so you put like your little... head in a cup, you become the cup, you know. Wow. <laughs> Jimmy, are you happy about the weapons you on must the have a small head if you can stick your head in the cup. I have probably. never purchased <laughs> I'm happy about them, I guess. I definitely want to see how they look like. I'm not very much a weapon style. I'm not a very stylish person well, if you... They... Did say they did say they're not new styles. It's just uh, the weapons themselves. Oh, it's just, well, it's just, it's hmm. just like higher. It's, they're higher than eighty eight, so they're, they're better good. than the weapons that drop in weight. Oh well, hmm. That has some ups and downs to it. I guess in a way, it's good that you have higher powers, but at the same time, it really negates doing the wave. If you know that if you do something else, you'll get a better weapon. That's true. That's true. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, uh, that's uh, some of my uh, friends in my league, we were talking about how Wave's going to end up being like like Prime is now for everybody. It's, it's going to be one of those raids that everybody does just to get defeats and then they're done. Yeah. You know, unless, unless, unless there's like an epic drop in there. Like everybody, I mean, there's still people trying to get the uh, Helm of Omnipotence from... Uh, which is weird, because isn't it isn't other stuff more better, anyways? Yeah, but I mean, oh. people just want that style, you know. People oh. want that style. Say they've got style. the home of OP. I, I've never I mean, seen it. Still want that? What is that? That that fuzzy head Captain Cold's helmet? Like for what? Yeah. Like, why is it yeah, so people, expensive? People, people farm and reset strikers. It's I a have cool, to say, it's a cool Captain, Captain Cold's head is ugly. The helmet is ugly. I know. I think, it I makes think it's no cool. sense to me. 
I think it's cool I mean, style. It's, yeah, I mean, it's it's cool looking, but I mean, it doesn't. I mean, your character like, is not it's like, unique. It's like a everyone status. Knows. It's like a status symbol thing, you know. It's it's yeah. like just a hat like from the, a team fortress. It's also the thing like the kick me sign, and also the yeah. scarecrow's cleaver and stuff. It has. Yeah, I have no... all of them, but I don't use them. I mean, all, all that tells me, all that tells me is, you know, I see people wearing those styles or flaunting those styles off and all that. You know, they're like, oh, you don't have a Captain Cold head? I'm like, dude, all you're telling me is either one, you had enough money to buy it, or two, you got lucky enough to get it dropped for you. Mm-hmm. And that, that's all it says. But I stopped that's worrying about says. styles. You know, if it, if it doesn't have a feet behind it, I stopped worrying about styles after Fight Fire with Fashion. After that, <laughs> I don't... But yeah. Nimbus Shows has a beautiful style already. He's he's pretty in anything he gets into. So I don't understand why people just freaking out over that. Just Speaking of your style, style Nimbus, you need, to, you need to get a haircut. I hate your dreadlocks or whatever. Yeah, I hate this. There we go. <laughs> it's so ironic that someone from the islands talking about getting a haircut. Hey, do you remember this? You racist. Remember that? <laughs> Me? <laughs> Those long-haired hippies. <laughs> <coughs> Who's from an island? Oh, wait. Are you talking about the moon? Okay. <laughs> no, I was... <laughs> First, okay, you didn't know we mind. had yellow lanterns. Now, you don't know that. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Wow. You know, I'm really out of it. Wow. I, and plus, who takes ge- geography classes anymore? I mean, then again... Is a, you are not making America oh, look good sorry. at all right now. You're <laughs> <laughs> killing us right now. Over there. I'm, I'm so I'm, sorry. Europe I've actually one. been to England. America though. zero. Oh yeah. I've actually been to England. We need to have no. you on a lot more. This is this is. Yeah, no, awesome. we brought it back with the twerking. So U.S. won. <laughs> oh yeah, yeah, yeah. We got twerking. <laughs> and plus, no, no, no. U.S. still wins because we don't call our lawns gardens. Yeah, gardens yeah, you are much... sponsored by Obama. I know. <laughs> Garden is much more appropriate. How is it? Wait, how is it appropriate though? Do you have flowers in your lawn? Yeah, I've got flowers. I've got like little. little what uh... kind of flowers do you have? All kinds, all, all kinds of flowers. Yes, yeah, some nice, oh. nice Did flowers. You plant them? I didn't personally plant them, but um, I have been known to water them occasionally. Oh, okay, <laughs> so you have a very green thumb. Okay, fine, we'll give you gardens. Thank you. We have lawns. <laughs> <laughs> See, I just, well, have I, I've been to America a few times, and all your lawns just look the same, just like, just been mowed over, and that's it. Just yeah. boring, 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 pretty much. It has to be. If you don't, they charge you for your um, homeowners association and stuff like that. Really? Oh man. Yes, oh, yeah. you get There's in trouble. Some... Yeah, yeah. You get in trouble. Yeah, we, I lived in. We can't I lived have in like house. beet fields and cotton plants in our lawns. Exactly. You know what I'm <laughs> we can't have dandelion <laughs> fields. There have to be like grass. <laughs> yeah, I lived in uh, when I lived in Maryland. In Germany, in Maryland. you smoke grass. <laughs> wow. Now grass means in Germany like wheat. Grass can yeah. be the normal, you know, normal, but also wheat. <laughs> yeah, <it's> <laughs> <laughs> but I don't smoke. I don't smoke. I just. I like how that. he added. I like. I like how he added that at the end. <laughs> yeah. But I don't do it. <laughs> yeah, I don't do it. Uh, no, no. Nope. You're, 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 your friend, your friend, your friend does it, right, Balkan? Your friend I'm a does hero. It. I don't smoke. Your friend, your friend doesn't. Your mate doesn't. Um, it's, I think y'all, are, y'all are embarrassing all the natures out there. You know, it's like, what's what's wrong with grass? What's wrong? With <laughs> it's from the earth. It's from the earth. In regards it's to the still from earth. <laughs> in regards to the gear and everything that was <laughs> dropping in the DLC, all right, uh, they've got you know they showed the three um, styles on. They they withheld the blue um, style for some reason. That they haven't, uh, they just said that well, they weren't ready to introduce it yet. But um, the uh, heroes are going to be able to earn uh, when they, you know, purchase uh, the Green Lantern set with uh, Marks, and villains will be able to purchase the Sinestro set with Marks, and the uh, Red Lantern set is going to be the drops in there. Um, and from my understanding, uh, we're still using Marks of Reality for all this, so. Mm, yeah. Save up on them. And Blue Hold Lantern on. gear comes with the light part too. Maybe, <laughs> and maybe they, they're pleasing a lot of fans with the emblems being in this in the styles. 
Mm. Yeah, you can you can't change the emblem color, but you can change the other chest piece colors. Yeah. Yeah. Well, uh, that's like about it like for um, War of the Light Part One, right there. Um, I think it's time for. Uh, um, oh, Jimmy's got to take off. Yeah. You have a good one, Jimmy. Thanks for uh, yeah. thanks for blessing us with your presence on the podcast, Miss Matt. Thank you very much for inviting me over, guys. I'm so sorry for the short stay, the life of right. real life and, you know, doing YouTube life. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> well, before you go, before you go one more time, can you tell us your uh, your Twitter and your YouTube? Hey, she said it. Why you want again? You forgot already. I wanted to because the people, <laughs> the people need to know. If, if people, people yeah, they can if they listen to the podcast. What's wrong with you, my well, friend? <laughs> look, man, look, man, you want for yourself. Hey, 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 hey. No, nah, I'm joking. Okay, tell us again. Tell can you, can you guys, like, <laughs> wait, tell wait, us again? Let, let, her, let, her, let her do her plug. Let her do her uh, Okay, plug <laughs> is about to begin. All right, youtube.com backslash DCUO Crisis Core. One word is our YouTube channel. You can also find me on Twitter at, at Geminis Gamer. And you can find me on Facebook if you have one um, with uh, Geminis01. Oh, you also have a Twitch channel too, right? Yes, I do. And um, majority of the times the link is in the the DCO channel. I at the moment I'm failing and I don't remember my Twitter. <laughs> We'll, I mean, we'll, my Twitch one. We'll put your links in the description. I'll, I'll take care of you. I'll, we'll, yeah, I'll put that in the description. We'll stick it in. Thank you very much, guys, for inviting me once again. And I hope to do this again. It was very fun. And thank you for keeping it uh, a little bit PG for me. <laughs> I know that usually you guys are a lot more, you know, excited and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> excited. Like, Bal Balkan's we never been so excited. <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. <laughs> all right well have a great day guys and continue on your talk wait, wait, can you say one more yes. double penetration please double penetration great success oh, okay, have a nice day <laughs> night Thanks, take care bye see ya Bal all right Balkan, well, you can't force well, girls to now, say say right. stuff like that why she said it before me <laughs> I mean, I say double He's celebration, then you say point. penetration, then I say it too now. <laughs> she said it was okay, so you know, when she said when it, it like open a floodgate for okay, then it's okay. Hey, listen, 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 listen. She's cool. She even said triple penetrations. She's over me, okay? She's beast. <laughs> she is beast. Watch out, guys. She is beast. But speaking of beast. We now have the uh, the segment that uh, I like to call Beast or Busted. That's right, folks. Beast or Busted oh. is the segment where if you like something, it's Beast, you know. But if you don't like it, it's a, it's a pretty Busted. You know we saying? call it so shit, we, not uh, Busted. Excuse me? Nah, talk, yeah. continue. Uh, okay, all right. So the, the first topic we're going to have is uh Jimmy, our, our, our guest that just left. Beast or Busted. Super Patriot go. What just oh, have what? definitely beast. What? Jimmy's definitely beast. I mean, she puts together like you know the the legends you know character um, guides and everything she puts out um, are some of the best I've seen put together. I mean, a lot of people you know they take these uh, tunes in the legends, they have no idea what some of the powers are doing and all that, and it's just it's they're just really great guides for everybody to uh, go and check out. Um, so I definitely uh, in, you know encourage anybody who's looking at you know trying out you know. Wonder Woman or Cersei or any of the other Legends characters she's done reviews on to go check out her uh, channel and uh, check out those reviews. They're really they're really good. Awesome, Belkin, Jimmy, Beast or Busted? She is busted that she is a beast. So beast, yeah. <laughs> busted. <laughs> How is she busted though? How is she busted? <laughs> now nah, I busted is like ah gotcha, you know. She's no, a beast. I think I think he's thinking. Of, I think he's. She's with, cool. With, She's beast. Yeah, she likes my voice. Hey. Nothing to say anymore. Yeah. <laughs> so I was, I and, was uh, thinking she was gonna kidnap Balkan for a little while there. She's just like, oh, he's real. so cute. Yeah, man. You know, <laughs> like, I was like... red my cheeks. You know. Balkan <laughs> <laughs> uh, <Vulcan> blushed. <laughs> that is so cute. I'm telling you, Balkan is the leader of Teen Titans now, dog. I can see him in that Teen Titans. Not Teen Titans. Justice League, my friend. 
Bet you. <laughs> All right, uh, Orbit, Beast or Busted? Beast, definitely Beast. She's, she's, she must say she, Beast. She's, she's, must got, say. <laughs> she's got the most professional channel uh, I've seen, most professional commentaries I've seen. So for that, Beast. Maybe she Excellent. works for well, IGN. Looks like we have a, a, a consensus of four to zero, Jimmy. It's definitely beast. So we're gonna go ahead and move on. I've got um, one actually. Oh, Nim- you got one. You know what? Go ahead on. What's 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 your beast of busted for this week? Nimbus Yosh, the people's champ, beast of busted. Boom! Oh, we are about yes. to we are about to see what's about going to, on. We're about to start roasting. You know to... what? I'm gonna put the list down. We're, we're... gonna start roasting this week, goddamn. <laughs> okay, I start first. Nimbus beast or busted. Nimbus say double penetration. Double penetration. Okay, he's beast. <laughs> <laughs> All right. That's not the question. That's not the, that's not what we're doing. <laughs> that's Shosh, that's only the question. Shosh, you didn't say the, the criteria champion. on anything. I'm gonna mark that down as beast. That's one for beast. <laughs> that's uh that's Nimbus. All right. Two patron. Nimbus Shosh. Beast of busted. Oh man. <laughs> Be nice, man. Or he don't come next podcast. Well, you see, it's like it's like it's like you know. I mean, what my answer is depends on how much of an earful I get later tonight on a game. <laughs> <laughs> and you know, my tongue flap on both ends, sir. I Yolo, know. I know. Yolo, Yolo, super. Don't be bullied into saying something that you don't want to say. <laughs> 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 Busted beast. <laughs> busted beast. A busted beast. Busted so beast. it's Everett. He's, I'll tell you, his, 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 uh, his commentary and his... Uh, um, I want to say... He has to think about... His, I mean, his, 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 I mean no, 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 no. Nimbus's commentary, I mean, I, mean, I mean, the dude can own people with words. You know, and that says a lot. All right? That says a lot about somebody right there. You can just own them with words. And all that that says a lot about that says a lot about you. Not because you can talk over them, but because you can talk above them. All right. So that says a lot about Nimbus right there. So that's how he's beast. He's busted though because I mean he's only got that one win against me, and you know I wasn't getting ready. I wasn't ready for that supercharged shit. <laughs> so I'm gonna go ahead and mark that down as beast. <laughs> If it's about you, you can't be keeping score. <laughs> <laughs> I'm being, look, I'm being impartial. Okay, I'm being impartial. I'm looking at Nimbus Shosh as Nimbus Shosh. Not as me, as Nimbus Shosh. <laughs> so, uh, Orbit, Nimbus Shosh, beast Yo. or busted? <laughs> Nimbus Shosh, the people's champ, beast or busted? I would beast kind, or busted? I'd kind of go beast and busted, but I'm leaning towards the busted. Because... Oh. And, uh, can you explain your... Uh, <laughs> Because we know, we know that the the rock is the only, <laughs> the only, mm. the People only champion. people's champ <laughs> ever. Okay, so so if I could prove to you that there's more than one uh people's champion currently living today, will you switch that vote to a uh, beast? No, because there's only one. There's one people's champion, and that's it. No, so if, but two. if I can prove there's you, two. if I can prove it otherwise, there's can two I go ahead and uh, get that beast vote from them? Yeah. Prove. All right. You heard it here, folks. <laughs> uh, we're gonna make we're gonna make Orbit eat his words. <laughs> eat so, his uh, words. I'm gonna ask myself, serious. Is Nimbus Josh beast or busted? Well, the answer is clear. <laughs> Okay, Nimbus Show started out with a cell phone and is now hosting the People's Podcast. You know, <laughs> Nimbus Show, like Super Patriot said, it's not talking uh, louder than you, it's talking above you. Nimbus Show can go from regular, humble, you know, mild mannered, talking like a dude, or he could preach the gospel of justice. I could go on and on, but we could have a whole podcast about Nimbus Show himself. I'm going to go ahead with Beast. So that's uh, what, three. <laughs> Three to one, beast. I think it's confirmed. Why three Nimbus to Shosh one? Why three? Is... Explain. Because he voted for well, himself. Can you say Nimbus <laughs> Shosh is beast? Patriot, 
lead towards beast. You know, people's champ. He's always going to say the people's champ is beast. And then orbit. He said leaning towards busting, but we're going to change that with a couple Wikipedia articles and whatnot, <laughs> uh, all up in his twitters and whatnot. So stay tuned. Stay tuned to orbit and Nimbus underscore Yosh on Twitter. We're going to get down <laughs> to the nitty gritty as far okay, as okay. Now Patriot beast or busted. Oh, oh, I think we are. Are we doing this? Everyone, everyone. <laughs> oh, we're doing. This. Everyone. Then... We're doing this, huh? All right, let's do it. Oh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna lead off first with this one. Um, I ain't even gonna mince words with you. Know what I'm saying Super Patriot is beast, you know, and I'm gonna tell you why. Since Super Patriot was on, uh, I think well, you were on Blood Will Run, right? No, I was on uh, No Man's Land. No man. Land. Okay, sorry about that. So, Sue Patriot was on No Man's Land. Now, um, I'm on The Killing Joke, and I'm hearing all the exploits about Meta Justice. I'm hearing about, you know, how beast Meta Justice is um, on the Blood Roll Run server. Like, that is the, that was the, the, the legacy of truth. That was the, so was the light on that particular server. So was the light, ain't nothing now. But back in the G, you know, when I ran it, so was the light was a beast. It was ridiculous. And Meta Justice, Meta Justice was like the Justice League. Meta Justice was just legendary. And at the top of all that, you had Super Patriot, who, if you look at the cover of DCUO, if you look at the cover art on the box, you got that one dude in that, you know, iconic pose kind of kneeling down or whatever. That's Super Patriot in a whole different costume. I don't know if y'all seen that. But that's who that is. Super Patriot is uh he he works with the community to make the community better, you know, inside and outside a game. Um, he does what it do, he finishes the job, he exemplifies what justice is. And even though he's a little bit um uh on the squeaky clean side, he doesn't like to really get his hands dirty and really get in somebody, you know, saying like the people's champ do. Super Patriot, I think, is way more positive than negative for the community. I'm going to say Super Patriot is beast. I agree. And no one say something, I say agree. Okay, cool. All right. so, he so likes double penetration. He's beast. Right. <laughs> you got two for beasted for Super Patriot Orbit. Yes. Super Patriot. Super the beast. Beast. Okay. My first it, commentator, you I yes. started watching DCO Beast. All right. And uh, Super Patriot, how do you feel about Super Patriot, Beast the Buster? Uh, all right. <laughs> I hate talking about myself like this. Dude, I mean, seriously, in all reality, I mean, I'm not doing anything that anybody else can do. All right. I mean, anybody else who's not willing to put in the time and, you know, and work towards, you know, the same goals. Yeah, you know, I'm not doing anything anybody else can do. I mean, never. I mean, you, you know, you had the same goals and all that same, you know, thought thoughts on you know the things that I do and all that. You can do it. Balkan can do it. Orbit's the orbit's doing it. You know, I mean, you know, and there's there's a lot of other people out there. I mean, that could you know do what I'm doing, not just to you know you know you know uh, improve their you know YouTube channel and everything like that, put out informative videos, but I mean, do stuff to help the community out. I mean, you know, put together, you know, community organized events, you know, like, you know, the Olympus uh, PVP uh, tournaments that I've done, that I've done um, which, you know, fostered the whole, you know, FNL tour, Legends tour uh, that they're doing now every every month now. Um, I mean, it's, it's all about, it's all about just, you know, dedication, professionalism, and, uh, you know, just you know, keep keeping your nose to the grind. You know, and getting a good support system behind you and all that. So I have a, I have a friend and all that who's helped me a lot with uh, helped me a lot with Olympus especially, and helped me out with my channel um, too as well. You know, giving me new fresh ideas I could try out and everything. You know, and, and all that. But I mean, I'm not really doing anything that y'all or anybody else out there listening can't do. You know, it's all about whether you want to put in the time and it's, if it's something you really want to do. I mean. Any anybody else? I mean, you know what I've done with you know my channel, the source cast, and everything with Trex Light, uh, you know, and now this podcast with y'all. I mean, anybody can do this. Anybody can do this, and all. But I mean, it's you've got if you're wanting to succeed at, you've got to you've got to take it. You've got to be professional about it. I mean, I mean, it's. I mean, uh, yeah, Orbit's channel's gotten a lot bigger than me. I mean, that's got a lot to do with um, not just orbit himself because orbit does great videos and informative videos and good guides and everything like that 
um, you know, it's got a lot to do with, uh, you know, the YouTube and how they promote videos and everything like that, which I think sucks, but you know, it's like, <laughs> oh, <laughs> but that's, that's, that's the one I mean, I've got, I've got get no, on that. Yeah, I've got no grudges against Orbit for getting for his channel getting bigger than me. I've got you know, and honestly, you know, anybody else whose channel ends up growing bigger than mine, I've got no grudges against that either. Because either it's you know because of the way YouTube promotes, or it's because you know I just haven't been putting out the content that everybody's looking for, which I honestly you know, I haven't been doing like this entire month because um, I've been working on something else uh, that involves the game. But like I said, I mean anybody can do what I do. Anybody you know if you. But if you want to do the thing like, you know, what I've done and, you know, not just, you know, my channel and the source cast and all that, but fostered a relationship, working relationship with, you know, the, the developers and everything, it's, you know, it's, you've got to, uh, you know, be that, you got to put on that professionalism. You, know? you got, you got to, you got to cinch your tie up, you know, and, you know, uh, you know, as the phrase goes, you got to dress for the job you want, not the job you got, basically. So I mean, if you want, if you want to get to where like me or where I'm at as far as like my connections with the developers and everything like that, you've got to put on that professional air. You know, you've got to you know be professional in what you do and how you do it, and not you know, not not get your hands as dirty as you know as others do. I mean, you know, there's nothing against you, Nimbus. As others I mean, do. <laughs> I mean, I mean, not, I mean, no, seriously, nothing against you, Nimbus, and all that. You do what you do, and you do it very well. You know, it's just, I mean, that's just not, you know, the direction I want my channel to go. But the, for what you do and all that, and you're prospering anyways. You know, I mean, you, 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 your, your, your channel is prospering uh, and all that. And plus, you know, you're starting to put out guys down all that. It's like you're whoring in on everybody else's action and everything. People are like, what the <laughs> hell is this? Nimbus Yosh doing a freaking loadout guide? What? You know? <laughs> um, <laughs> I mean, All right, so uh, yeah. so 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 let's let's wrap that little little thought up because we got a, a a couple others to get to. <laughs> Super Patriot, are you yourself beast or busted? I, that's that's not an answer. That's not a question I'm willing to answer. Because I don't right, like. Well, it's it's I mean, it's three to uh, nil <laughs> as far as that's concerned. So I think we certified that uh, Super Patriot is a uh, it's pretty beast. So next week we're gonna get on orbit and we're gonna get on uh uh Belkin to see whether or not they can pass the test to see if they're beast or oh, bust. No. So a couple other couple other things uh, <laughs> let me out of this thing. <laughs> <laughs> no too late. Too late. As soon as All you include right. beast so, token, you're in it. <laughs> right. All right, Next so check this out. Check this out. I know so I will be got a couple, I'm sorry guys. <laughs> so we got a couple of uh fan made uh submissions to Beast or Busted. So um one is uh lower levels in legend matches is that beast of busted we're going to start out with belkin beast of busted i don't understand what this means i'm sorry like level 10s level 19s level 12s in legend pvp matches is this good or bad beast or busted it's okay in my opinion i don't know why is why should it be bad it's legends not mm -hmm. your stats so yeah that's why it's legends. You don't fight with your character. I mean, if you fight as level 30 with your character against level 12, no chance. But legends is, I mean, my opinion, completely okay. Legends are here. Yeah. I don't know, man. What do you want? Leave me, man. <laughs> <laughs> Just say beast or busted. I say it's um, not beast or not busted. It's average. Okay, let's say it's beast. I don't know. <laughs> it's, it's not broken. All right. Uh, Orbit, how do you feel about it? Beast. Let, like when I was doing, <clears throat> when I was doing my um, Let's Play, doing queuing up for Legends is a nice little break, get away from, like just change it up a little bit. And you can work, up, like use whatever weapon you want with the Legend characters. And um, yeah, it's good. Well, I don't understand why they would ever have that as, you know, you can only do legends once you're ever level 30. Um, so, Beast. All right. Super Patriot, your thoughts, sir? I think it's Beast. I mean, I, I, I can guess why this was brought up, and it's because people complain about lower levels being on their team and all that, and, you know, you know, people going in with Robins and Harleys <laughs> and everything, and, you know, and thinking that, oh, God, you know, I've got this level five in here with a Robin. 
and all that. I think it's a beast. Uh, honestly, I think any anybody who's bef- who goes into Legends and all that or any kind of PvP before they hit level 30, I think it's fantastic. I think it's, it's not something they need to stop you know, doing in the game. I think it's completely beast that people are willing to go up against, you know, and, you know, these are probably people who don't realize it, too. You know, people who uh, are going into these matches, you know, not realizing that, you know, they're, based, they're still on an even par with these level 30s that they, they're facing off against, even though they've got Robin. And honestly, you know what? Robin and Harley are not bad Legends tunes. No it's just, you just got to know how to use them. I don't know how to use them. Yeah, I don't know how to use them either. Take that ass into Legends. You need to visit Gemini's channel. I use Sinestro (laughs) always. Sinestro. Okay. And I mean, you know, when you you can actually buy those characters, you know, before you hit level 30. So you could be level 5 and walk in with Zod. You could be level 17 and walk in with, I don't know, who's who's another one you could buy? Wonder Woman. You know, theoretically. I am correct on that, right? Yeah, 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 yeah. I don't see. I don't so see why. Not. Um, I don't see why people complain that the level, the lower levels would be in their group. If if you're gonna complain about that, you just get a pre-made group. Um, before going right, in, exactly. right? So and you've here's got something, the, here's something the everybody. Here's 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 something <clears throat> everybody should think about and all that when they're complaining about these low levels that they're either facing or that they're on their team. There is a ranking system in this in this game. All right, that you know groups you up against and with people of a similar ranking as you. So if you're worried about losing a match because you're in a you're in a legends match with a level six who's using Robin, right? Maybe it's not so much him, maybe it's you. <laughs> wow. You the thing you is look, I can <laughs> look, look, maybe the level six one is a good character in my opinion. Look, because people are creating new characters, go then play level six. And Robin, he already have, I mean, a strong character, but just he do legend with a weak character because he wants to level up, blah, blah, blah. And yeah, and people think, ah, this is a new player. Maybe it's an old player just with the new tune. Who knows? Yeah. Another good reason gotcha. for it is because So it looks she... like we got a, like, my vote doesn't even matter on this, even though I will Cut say in. this real quick. Cut me you know, it's, it's legends, you know. But let, get in the, it's not your character. If you go into legends... You know, it's not like, you know, oh, I beasted out uh, Orbit or I beasted out Belkin. No, you beasted out Zod. You beasted out Wonder Woman and whatnot. It's it's okay. It's Legends. Let the little guys come in and uh, and help them out. Teach them. Or if they're on the opposite faction, beat the stank out of them and set the tone for the rest of their DCU old career. I think it's a, a four to zero. It's it's beasted. I mean, excuse me. It's beasted. Yeah, it's beast. Yeah, it's beast. beast. You know, so we're going to move on to the next one. Um, Let's see. Uh, The server separation. And by server separation, we mean, um, you know, U.S. different from the European server, the PC server different from the PlayStation server. Uh, This separation is this beast of busted. Now, we're going to go to the other side. We're going to start with Super Patriot. Is this beast of busted? Um. Yeah, that's a hard one to say, man. Because at one point, in one side, you know, I gotta say it's it's busted because you know there's some people you know on the EU that you know you know deserve a smacking around. I mean, you know, you know and everybody out there, I'm sure everybody out there would like to see uh, you know an Orbit versus Super Patriot or a Orbit versus Nimbus Yosh or a Super Patriot versus Balkan or something like that. Um, on the other hand, though, you got to look at the uh, service stability. Right. With that, um, you know, that, you know, where you got people, different people, you know, dealing with lag issues, you know, where would the server be located? I mean, would you put the server in Iceland, you know, where it's equally in between, you know, both continents, you know, <laughs> and uh, yeah, that way, you know, everybody's got the same amount of lag, um, you know, and, you know, and on top of that, I mean, they're adding an Asian server and all that. So obviously there's, there's a reason why the servers are separate and most likely it's got to deal with the, you know, the, are you uh, sure flag there's and everything an Asian like that. server? That's last I heard, man, they, I, I remember reading or them saying somewhere that they were adding, they Is were going to add an Asian or server. Or no, it's not out one. yet. Oh. It's not out yet, but they're going to add one from my understanding. Yeah. Lord, then we see Batman talking Asian, you know, <laughs> <laughs> Ching Kong, well, Batman, Ching Kong, huh? Japan, so, I, I can see that. Speak, speaking of Batman, Belkin, 
Uh, the server separation. Beast the bus. <laughs> what server separation? This is not together. Yeah, like the, like the, the separation of the server. The, the me and you not being on the same server. Is yeah, this, this is not beast nice because we know each other, but I mean... Uh, I will seriously play with other servers together. I mean, again, server mage. I think that will be beast if it's. But I say it's busted because we are not together. I mean, uh, mm -hmm. I mean, look, you. We have some guys that you don't want on your server together. You, you have maybe guys that we don't want maybe here. I don't know. Right. I don't have any problem with the US player or, but yeah, I. Lot of people have. To, you know who I don't want to say his name like Voldemort from Harry, Harry Potter you know <laughs> yeah. wow Shmigo. I mean really we could, we could have it you know, some, of, some of your trolls but seriously, or my, some of my our favorite trolls server, one sec my favorite <clears throat> server is I have to say the UPC I mean I will play with them with my character this will be my dream keep dreaming man so, so I'm going to say that you I'm gonna say that you say this is busted. That you know there should be, you know, a merger of the servers, if you will. Yeah. All right. Cool. And uh, Orbit, I think you. I'm not sure. Did you do videos about this in the past? I think you might have something to say about this. Beast of busted, sir. Um. Did I say something about this? I I thought you Just did. Just say no. You, what you if you didn't talk about it, no, I know for sure that your sidekick did long time. <laughs> <laughs> okay, <laughs> um, I'm gonna say Beast. I think they should be separate okay. because if they are, because he's scared. <laughs> <laughs> if they um, <laughs> if they linked all of the servers together, like Super Patriot said, there's no way it it would be able to cope with the amount of players there at the same time. And the only reason for it, the only way it would have to work is if a load of players left and it was pretty much on the verge of dying and they didn't have enough money to run the servers and they've had to merge it together. So mm. to me, merging the servers is, it will bring DC down. Although, no, like, although no, yeah, no, I'd no, like, no, like, no, like to. We all remember mega servers, right? We all remember the mega servers, right? When yes. they combined. Yeah, I mean that was like two weeks of hell, right there. <laughs> not not being able to do any open world PvP. Yeah, that my was server horrible. was so nice. That, After Mega Server, only dickheads here. I man. I could not, I, I literally <laughs> could not play. It, the game was unplayable for me. I I logged on and DC'd instantly when I was outside. It was yeah. It was I remember bad. people get mad at me in open world because I'd kill them in open world. And even though we were in the PvP phase and all that, I'd kill them in open world. When they respawn back in, they were stuck in a PvE phase, or in uh, they could their, their PvP flag was off and they couldn't turn it back on, so they couldn't go out and fight anybody. <laughs> <laughs> it was stuff purple until they reset their whole game. That was yeah. awesome. <laughs> when you died, you died for real. Yeah. <laughs> wow. Yeah. No so, rematch. I will only stay in my base. <laughs> never go out. <laughs> right. So uh, I think we have a consensus. Uh, I agree with Orbit, and I agree with Super Patriot for the exact same reasons. It's it's a server issue. You can't because there there are some people that uh for a whole year specifically, you know, I want to lay hands on. And there's but but there's also some people that they need their own server. <laughs> you know what I'm saying those trolls did <laughs> it. Those type of people that will sit there and abuse the um, the scrim system, abuse the what is that, the voice chat system and whatnot. Those guys need their own server. They need their own Australia penal colony. So just, I'm gonna say, you know, even though it's a little bit, it's a little bit busted. I'm gonna say that it's beast. So that's a that's a three or one to if, beast. If and that, um, if you all three against happen. me, comment me. Come on. If, if that <laughs> and we're gonna have one more. <laughs> If we're gonna happen. we're gonna go ahead and shut this down. We're actually gonna get in the, the we had two more after this, but we're gonna save that for the next episode. You have a lot last of questions, one, my friend. I know. Last Can't one get got to talk about it. <laughs> got to talk about it. Photon blast. Belkin. Is this beast or bust? Photon blast beast for the wind. Don't touch it. <laughs> <laughs> Don't touch my photon, or you are on my ignore list. 
Okay, so <laughs> so why why do you say that Photon is beast? Because I'm gadget and I love it. <laughs> <laughs> that's not a valid. That's not a valid reason. All right. Uh, let's see which one we're gonna pick. Um, we're gonna. I'm gonna save myself. Uh, Photon Blast. Yo. There's a little video floating around. I ain't going to big up the video, nor big up the dude that do it, because he's a cheating bastard himself. I've shown in other videos. Um, The dude would hit you with the heat vision and then photon spam you to death and think he is a god and think he is beast. Who? And, and I mean, you know, it's, it's these type of people that hop, from a now, I can understand hopping from one power to another to kind of feel around with the power, play around with it, you know, see what's right for you and so on and so forth, and do commentaries on it, which is also good. But the people that follow the flavor of the month just because it's the most beast power, and not just because it's the most beast power, but because it has the most beast power, because you know you can you can glitch with it, or it's just way more overpowered than all the other classes and whatnot, like. You know, either, you know, celestials that just bang on the buttons or people that go to gadget and photon spam you to death. You know, it's it's quite busted. It's every, quite busted. Every power has something that is, you know, people say mm. OP. Now, gadget right. and photon. Now, look, mental mental yeah, players. Listen, listen. Mental players have the reflection shield. This is right. strong as well. Every power has something Name that makes it very powerful. Is, you just have to know how to play. I don't know what you're talking about that one. Don't don't touch that one. Come at me. Now you I touch my photon, I take it personal. Okay, I touch mental. <laughs> <laughs> we're, look, we're gonna talk about uh, reflect pain on the next episode, but this episode. Yeah, I will. I say about, reflect you know, pain is busted, guys. Remember this. I've done it. <laughs> look, reflect pain is way less busted. We can have yeah, a yeah, yeah, way less. Reflect Fuck you, man. Way oh, less busted. Here's, right. here's my thing. The only thing that nullifies photon blasts is reflect pain. So here's I'm gonna say that photon blasts. Buku busted. Buku busted. L l lower the ticks. Don't lower the damage, but lower the amount of ticks from that monkey. Because, I mean, it's just a steady blah, 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 blast. Unsup your channel. It's bullshit. It's bullshit. Um, Super Patriot, how you feel about the Photon Blast, sir? I, mean, I, I know those, those people you're talking about. The Photon one-handed block breakers, that's all they do. Um... And I, I agree with you. I agree with you on that. They need to do something. They need to do some balancing with Photon Blast, right? I mean, Vulcan, I mean, I, I'd hate to see them nerf it, to be honest with you, because I, I do like Photon Blast. I've got a Gadgets tune. I do like Photon Blast myself. But if they're going to keep Photon Blast the way it is, then they need to make all the other 35 percenters hit just like it does. And I wouldn't mind my execution. So, so, in, I, so in, that, in that essence... In that essence, from that viewpoint, I say it's busted. I don't like because it. because it's not a balanced thirty five percent or like the others are. <laughs> All right, Orbit. How do you feel about the folds? Uh, you, I've seen you actually do a video, and that video was actually pretty awesome. Um, the one where you know what's what power set would you have if you could take all the powers from any power sets? You know, and Photon Blast was one of the first ones you talked about. Yeah, uh, yeah, pontificate yeah, yeah. on that. <laughs> <laughs> Um, yeah, I'd go busted as well. Now, I, th I think the main problem with it is because you've got like, like sandblast. It goes, you've got like the little hit, and then boom, you you got two two hits, one little one and one big one when they're below thirty five percent. Final ruin, one little one, one big one. Um, mm -hmm. And if they're above thirty five percent, that big one will hit them for like three hundred or like a rubbish number. But photon Fol blast, like you say, you hit them like how many times does it hit? It's like four times, isn't it? Yeah, it's just like better, better, better. So you can't like even if you hit, and, and, and it's pushing you back. Yeah, and it's pushing you back. And so I mean, <laughs> so yeah, you hit him for hit him for four times at three hundred each. You, you you're always going to do more damage than say sandblast, which is spam like two ticks. You're yeah, all, and you're, more damage than what Snuff Out does, more damage than what Impaling Ice does. Yeah, all of it. You know, I mean, that's why I said that. They need to make them all the same as Photon Blast or, you know, make Photon Blast the same as the rest of them. Yeah, exactly. So basically make them even with the rest of the powers. Yeah, I mean, I mean no, no, I mean, if you're going to, if you're going to have, you know, like almost every power in the game have a 35 percenter like that, then they all need to perform the same. 
mm-hmm. or similar. Or I, mean, I, I want to use the the words that they like to use. Put make the powers on uh, on par or eat or, or in line. That's the word. Make the powers in line with the other powers of similar order. So yeah, that's a. That, I, I think it's the definition of what busted is. So I think it's a three to one. Sorry, Belkin. Photon blast. You both, I remove. You're busted, not beast anymore. <laughs> mm-hmm. Three to one photon blast, you know, busted. <laughs> but what do you guys think in the comments? Is photon blast beast or busted? No, don't other... say it in the comments. <laughs> <laughs> this is the people's podcast. We want the people to have a voice. And uh in our next in our next podcast, you can have a chance to actually have a, a shout out from one of the four titans of YouTube. You know, just put your name on, on in the comments or whatnot, and we're going to get back to you. So, um... <laughs> you going to discuss that else? with us? <laughs> yeah, we're, we're definitely going to discuss that, you know, but we're going to give you a shout out. We're actually going to say your name on the podcast. Like, for instance, shout out to uh, It's J Live and Taylor Phoenix for their suggestions. Uh, for their suggestion videos, as well as the suggestions in the comments for Beast of Busted this week. You know, sorry, I kind of dragged on a little bit, you know, but, you know, thanks for, uh, thanks for actually giving us that feedback. We actually thrive on that feedback that you give, that you give guys. So keep it coming. We love it. Keep it moving. So is there anything else we want to talk about? Because I think we're running on, what, two hours? <laughs> uh, I think we're running on like an hour and a half right now. Yeah, yeah we're about a, an hour up. and a half. So, yeah. uh, yeah, how we feel about it. All right. Um, shameless plug time. Let's wrap it up. Shameless plug time. Uh, <laughs> you can follow the People's Champ at Nimbus underscore Yosh on Twitter, or you can check them out at um, YouTube.com uh, slash X, Darkwing104X double penetration. on YouTube. <laughs> it's not a double penetration yet. Uh, so, yeah, just check either one of those out. You know what I'm saying? The link's going to be down low in the doobly-doo. Orbit, can you give us some uh, some shout outs and whatnot? I'm going to do a shout out to Alexander Washington. I'm just on the I'm just on the People's Podcast episode ten, and he left a comment saying awesome video. So shout out to Alexander Washington. Alexander hey. Washington, part of the people, doing what it do. Uh, so can you give us your uh, is your his last plugs? name Washington? Yes. This is a powerful name. How, how do we get how do we get more <laughs> orbit in our lives? How do you get more well hmm, how do we get more you orbit, orbit into your life? What is your what is your Twitter? What is your your YouTube? <laughs> what is all ah, okay, right, right. That's that kind of stuff you're after. Mm-hmm. Right. Well you can find me at youtube.com forward slash full metal heroes at orbit underscore EU. Uh, for Twitter and I have a Facebook page. I don't even know. Don't know. Really, don't know what it is. <laughs> or a bit or something well, like that. Hopefully, we're gonna go ahead and put that in the doobly. <laughs> we're gonna have that. Yeah. Uh, Big Brother Belkin. You know, do you have any shout outs? And can you give us your information on how we can find you? Okay, YouTube is Balkan Let's Play. Uh, Twitter is Balkan Let's Play. Facebook is Balkan Let's Play. Hashtag double right. penetration in your phone. Hashtag finding. double <laughs> penetration <laughs> versus double triple penetration. penetration. Um, point. Um, do you have any shout outs? Any uh, personal messages you want to give out? Mm, Photon is strong. It's not busted. Nah, joking. Uh, <laughs> he wants to give a shout out to Photon Blast. No, no, no. What to All say? Right. I don't know. You got, no, you got nobody you want to shout out? What is Nobody you want to say hi to on the podcast? Hello, everyone. Hello, I love you all. Great success. <laughs> Great success. He wants to say to all the people giving a shout out. Super Patriot. How can we get more Super Patriot in our life? And do you have a shout out that you want to give out to the people? Yeah, I do. Uh, well, you can find me, of course, at my YouTube channel, youtube.com slash the Daddy's House. I am also on Facebook. Book at facebook.com slash the daddy's house and i am on the twitter at the daddy's house there i also have a twitch channel which i have not been using very much hopefully i'm hoping to get some more use out of it here 
in the future. That is twitch.tv slash the daddy's house there. As for my shout outs, I want to give a big shout out to my buddy Trexlight and all that. Help. We've been working on this project together. We're finally at the end of it. And uh, we'll both be able to get back into doing videos for you all. I also want to give a big shout out there to all of my fans and all that. You guys are the reason why I keep doing what I do and all that. And I want to give a shout out to my haters as well. Because if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't get so much enjoyment. I'll keep continuing to piss you off every day by still doing what I do. And give a shout out yeah, to Yeah, I say the same. The I copy your shout too. So what <laughs> he says, that counts for me too. Thank you. <laughs> and uh, I want to give a shout out to everybody that thought that uh, I couldn't sit here and be a co-host or a host of a podcast thinking that, that I didn't have the gift of gab. Shouts out to y'all. And... My haters love me, you know what I'm saying? So, and since I, <laughs> y'all ain't got haters like me, I'm going to give a special shout out to them. And definitely the shout out to the people, not just the peoples that follow the people's champ, but the people in general. Thank you for listening to the podcast. On behalf of the YouTube Titans, the voices of the people of DCUO, Orbit, Belkin, Super Patriot, this is the people's champ, Nimbus Shows, wishing y'all a very happy, happy holidays we're not going to be on next week because we got our holiday things to do you know real life comes before game so no. hopefully i can go back check out our channels you know what i'm saying keep keep it tight keep it right mind your butter and holla back at your boy percy <laughs> percy <laughs> only one of y'all said it. all right we're gonna, do, we're gonna it. do it again you know what we'll do it live we'll do it live <laughs> one more time uh, be good stay safe Mind your butter and holla back at your boy. Get on my level yes, or get on my lawn. <laughs> we just go ahead and shut it down. Y'all have a good one. Stay safe this holiday season, guys. And thank you for listening to the People's Podcast. Double Merry penetration. <laughs> Merry Christmas. And celebration. <laughs> <laughs>